Well, hello there. Uh, I'm going to do a restaurant review. I haven't done one in a little while here. It's because I'm not eating out as much, um, and that's fine. Um, uh, tonight I went to a place called uh, Cruisers in Sheboygan, Wisconsin. Um, I actually was um, uh, not feeling well today, and I stayed home sick, actually. I wasn't feeling well, but I was feeling better as the afternoon wore on. Um, so I will have to go back to work tomorrow. But um, I um, had dinner with my parents and my daughters at a place called Cruises. It's a uh, kind of like an outdoor, well, in, indoor. It's like an old-time custard-type place. Um, you know, your basic fare, hamburgers, hot dogs, chicken, and they serve ice cream, custard, whatever. Um, and it's like, got a Harley-Davidson motif inside. It's attached to a Harley store, actually, where you can buy a Harley products, um, Harley-Davidson products. So anyway... Uh, we went, and uh, what day is they? Uh, uh, Wednesday, August 8th, and uh, let's check out. Let's look at the clips. All right, we are at Cruiser's Frozen Custard and Jumbo Burgers in Sheboygan, Wisconsin. I've eaten here a couple times in the past. We're right next to Highway 43. And I'm not sure what this access road is here. I think that's a Holiday Inn over there, though. We're going to go in and eat. I think they have either ice cream or malts or something to flavor the day. I'm not sure. We're going to check it out. I decided to get the bacon double cheese, which you can't really tell, but this is the inside. There is a Harley Davidson motif. They have 24 flavors of ice cream, including apricot, blueberry, coffee, black cherry, maple nut, tutti frutti. Double cheeseburger. Um, yeah, have your dad. Go. Chili. Chicken wrap. What is this? Chili cheese dog. What does it look like? And nuggets and fries. Do they have a fork over there? Here's the bathroom at Cruisers. I have no complaints about cleanliness. Very clean. And a changing table. There are pictures of cruisers being built way back when, who knows when. Looks like maybe the mid 80s. And they have pictures of the patrons who have patroned to this place. Pictures of drive-ins. And here is the seating area. And it is connected to a, a Harley store. <clears throat> Turn in chocolate. Peanut butter, how is it? Good. Peanut buttery. Butter pecan. So there you have it. That's my clips from Cruisers. Um, overall, I did not pay for the meal, but uh, overall, I think it was about twenty-nine dollars. Not bad for uh, five people. My uh, burger was actually pretty flavorful. Um, if I have one complaint about the food, and it's your standard fare, so I mean, you you know what you're getting. I thought the the French fries were a little too salty. Or a little too, uh, whatever. Uh, the French fries were really good, actually. They were kind of crisp and uh, uh, kind of that darker type of French fry. Um, I, I did like them. However, they're just a tad bit salty for me. Um, I think our, our waiter's name was Ryan? Or was it Kyle? I think it was Kyle. Kyle. I think there was a Y in it. Kyle S, maybe? I don't know. Anyway, um, I like tartar sauce with my French fries. Um, and so I went up and asked for tartar sauce, and they have it. They gave me it free. Thank you. 
and um, I had the uh, the my my burger was really good. I had a bite of the chili dog that my daughter ate, which was good. And the nuggets were actually good too. My other daughter had nuggets. They didn't taste like McDonald's nuggets. I do like McDonald's nuggets. Um, it had a different type of flavor to it, but it was also good. Um, the bathrooms were were clean. The the actual um, dispenser for the uh, paper towel was broken. Uh, it wasn't working at the time. Um, I should have notified somebody, but I didn't. Um, I think it was just jammed or something. Uh, it was it was working. It just wasn't out, so you couldn't grab another one. Um, and uh, as we were leaving, um, I was going to throw our sodas away. You, they actually, this is a place that actually they actually serve the soda. I mean, they have the soda thing behind the counter. You can't get it yourself like you can in a lot of fast food places. Um, and didn't even know if refills were free. I hadn't even tried. But um, as we were leaving, uh, I was taking the tray, and the guy behind the counter said, I'll take that for you. Um, which was kind of cool, very nice of, uh, I believe it was Kyle. Um, and uh, I had the drinks up there, I was throwing them out, they were just about empty, and he said, would you like refills for the road? And I did. In fact, here it is. Here is my Mountain Dew. I wasn't really thirsty, but I thought, eh, well, this will last me the rest of the night. Um, so I got it. So I thought that was pretty cool that he offered for nothing. So, ah. So there you go. Uh, all in all, I would give cru uh, Cruisers a, a positive review. I enjoyed it. I would go back there again, um, try something different next time. Um, again, they had uh, like several different flavors of ice cream too. Uh, I had the, I tried the German chocolate. I tried the butter pecan. I tried the peanut butter. It was all good. All good, 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 good. So anyway, no complaints about Cruisers. It was a good meal. And um, if you're in Sheboygan, check it out. It's right off the highway. Um, you can literally see it from the highway. It's right there on the... Uh, east side of uh, 43 right in the middle by the um what is that highway pp exit i don't know anyway but it's by target and best buy and walmart so anyway check it out cruisers bye